Hi, this is Mark Morell from Toon Barn. We're here at WonderCon 2018. We're talking about Suicide Squad Hell to Pay. I'm here with Kristen Bauer von Stratton. Oh my gosh, you did the whole thing. Uh, and you play Killer Frost. I do, I do. She's very, she's very killer, very frosty, bitchy, super fun. Okay. So in preparing for this role, did you see the other versions of Killer Frost before you, or is this completely fresh take? Completely fresh take. That's partly because I don't want to have another actress's voice in my head. Mm -hmm. I didn't watch Angelina's Maleficent before I played her. Um, that's the main reason. Some people might call me lazy, but really it, it is that I, I will be overly impressed with the, the other actresses. How did you react when you found out you got this role? Oh, I loved it. You know, I've been wanting to get into voiceover more and more, and I find... Uh, I, I really like the interesting voice that I used for Pam on uh, True Blood, so I kind of feel like this is something that I, I could do, and maybe some people would want me to do it. So when that happened, I was super happy. Yeah. And of course, you're working together with a bunch of other voice actors who are playing this Suicide Squad. Yes, yes. And they're, they're kind of reluctant heroes. Yes, very, very reluctant, actually. You know, they, they each have their own agenda. There's really only one character who is more noble. And it, it, these conventions are fun because I actually didn't know who played the other roles because we did everything solo in the studio. So I had to IMDB Suicide Squad and see who the other actors were and then meet them today. So it's really fun to be together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if there was any other character in the DC universe that you would want to play, who would it be? You know, th I'm going, that's, that's um, embarrassing because I, I have a very hard time keeping track of who's in the DC world. <laughs> so, versus, other versus, versus other comics because I, I didn't go, grow up reading the, right. the comics. So to me, when I go to the movie, it's just that first little bit that goes by really quickly that tells me what universe I'm in. So what do I have some choices? What's on the menu? Oh, man, there's a lot. Oh, yeah, uh, see, now you're like, oh, uh, yeah, you could be Batgirl, you could be, you know. Oh, Batgirl, yeah, I mean, okay. Yeah, Batgirl has never been, uh, Catwoman, you know, was certainly got to have more fun, I think. You know, that I love the way Michelle Pfeiffer played her. I want to thank you for joining us on Toon Barn at WonderCon. Yes, thank you. It was a very interesting process that I, I loved. It's a little bit different than being on camera because the script isn't, you don't read it like, I, I actually didn't know the story and what happens until I watched it this week. And then I had to IMDB who else was in it and then ask who would be here. And then I show up and I'm like, oh my gosh, Greg, Lee, ah, you know. I so, okay. I, <laughs> uh, well, next time. But I, uh, so it's really fun to go into the booth and just say the dialogue and try to not mess it up and be true to the sarcasm and the, and the killerness pardon my fun of the character and then as the process goes you know then you go back a year later and you're doing ADR which is mainly the physical grunting noises and the fighting stuff and I get to see what I look like some fabulous artist drew me so beautifully and I get to see what these other fabulous Michael did and so it's it's an amazing process that gets better as it goes actually Blow me up now. You heard of Killer Frost? The Ice Queen. There have been versions of Killer Frost that had different secret identities and different origin stories. For Killer Frost, we went with the Crystal Frost version, which was the first version. Nobody knows what I'm capable of. Our version of Killer Frost comes from an abusive home, and uh, she learns early on that life's not fair, and that you know even people who are supposed to love you are gonna, you know, can hurt you. And uh, that's her viewpoint going into the movie, and that's what's basically created her demeanor of coldness and, and being um, aloof, and also given her and uh, the gallows humor that we play up a lot in the movie. Ho ho. 
Ho. Kristen Bauer is our killer frost. She lends so much to just a one word line or adds so much flavor to just a throwaway sarcastic moment. Seriously. I think we're being summoned. Oh! 